hate Israel, the brother Bakala Walum, here with a hopeful, edifying video for the body of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rakakadash, and double honors to the apostles, to the apostles and elders that I learned the truth from, men of GMS, and the brethren with a like mind of doctrine. Um, and yeah, I have um, this article here. And it's like here on, on Shalom to the Akim and to the Aqua. I have this article here. Um, and it reads, um, Pent Pentagon warns of, a, of an increased potential for nuclear conflict in newly discovered manual. And it reads, the risk of regional conflicts between nuclear armed nations is rising according to a document prepared by the chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff. I'm gonna read a little bit of it. Um, more likely, I'm gonna put a copy of, of this article in the um, description box so you can um, read at your leisure. Um, and it says a U.S. military manual that only recently became public says that the world now faces a high, higher probability of conflicts involving involving nuclear weapons. And I w really want to jump down to I jump down to here a copy of of the manual titled Joint Publications 3-72 3-72 Joint Nuclear Operations was obtained by the Federation of American Scientists, FAS, last week through the Freedom of Information Act's FOIA and post, posted online on July the 6th. And I just want to jump down to, um, to this portion. Um, and it reads, the manual then lists specific technologies and policies being pursued by these nations, which it claims are leading to increased potential potential for a nuclear conflict to occur. In addition to the modernizing to mod, modern modern Slovakia modern modernizing legacy Soviet nuclear systems. Russia is developing and employing a new nuclear warhead, warheads and launchers. It is also deploying Slovakia developing three new intercontinental range nuclear weapon systems, a hypersonic glide vehicle, a nuclear arm, nuclear power powered ground launch cruise missile and a nuclear nuclear arm nuclear powered uh, undersea autonomous torpedo China has has developed a new road mobile uh, strategic intercontinental ballistic missile ICBM a new multi-warhead version of its DF-5 silo-based ICBM and, it, and its most advanced ballistic missile submarine armed with, with new submarine launched ballistic missiles SLBM Slaki SLBMS I mean Slaki SLBMs Slaki it has also announced development of a new nuclear capable strategic bomber giving China a nuclear triad. In the past few weeks, North, North Korea has dramatically increased its missile flight testing, most recently including a testing of intercontinental range missiles capable of reaching U.S. homeland. Iran retains the technology capability, capability and much of the uh, capacity necessary 
to develop a nuclear weapon within a year within one year of this decision to do so. Iran's development development of increasingly long range ballistic missiles ballistic missile capability and its um, aggressive strategy and activities to destabilize neighboring governments rise, rises raises questions about its long-term commitment to for, foregoing nuclear weapons capability. So you know that it just basically went into um, um, uh, you know uh, um, description of these different nations building up their nuclear arsenal. You know, and what that comes to what comes to mind is Joel. The chapter three said, "Let the weak say I'm strong." Joel three, and I'm gonna start at verse nine. Proclaim ye this among the Gentiles: Prepare war. Wake up the mighty men. Let all the men of war draw near. Let them come up. Beat your plowshares into swords and your pruning hooks into spears. Let the weak say I'm strong. You know, assemble, your, assemble yourself and come, all ye heathen, and gather yourself together round about. Thither, thither calls thy might, mighty ones to come down, O Yahweh. Let the heathen be weakened and come up to the valley of Jehoshaphat, for there will I sit to judge all the heathen round about. Put ye in the sickle, for the harvest is right. Come, get, come, get you down, for the press is full, and the fats overflow, for their wickedness is great. Verse 14, Multitudes, multitudes in the valley of decision, for the day of Yahweh is near in the valley of decision. The sun and the moon shall be darkened, and the stars shall withdraw their shining. See that? The, the, the sun and the moon shall be darkened, and the stars will withdraw their shining. That's that after this nuclear destruction, when those, when those missiles are shot, shot from the four corners of the earth, you know, intercontinental ballistic missiles are shot all over this own world. You know, the moon from the... the, the um, the residue or debris, the um, that's gonna be um, that's that's gonna be left from the impact of the uh, missiles hitting. You know, it's gonna blacken. It's gonna blacken out the sun. You know, blacken out the sun. Basically, blacken out the um, the sky. You won't be able to see anything. You know, so that's what it's just basically describing in verse 15. So that's what it is. Let the weak say, "I'm strong." All these other nations are building up their arsenal for, for what? For um, the valley of decision, you know? Um, let's go on to the definition of Jehoshaphat, what Jehoshaphat means. The valley of Jehoshaphat. Uh, Yahweh Shapat. Yahweh Shapat. Um, Yahweh has judged, you know. That's basically that's what it is. Yahweh has judged the, the Yahweh Shapat. The why Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. But uh, yeah, that's what I wanna that's the um valley of decision. Yahweh decision. Yahweh will, will where Yahweh would judge these nations for the controversy of Zion. But yeah, I'm, I'm gonna leave a, um, leave the link to this article in the description box. You know, I hope the um, you know, it's a quick, a little quick short lesson. Hope the body of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah will edify. I'm gonna say, um, Barakatai Yahweh, Barakatai Yahweh Shah, Barakatai Yahweh, Barakatai Yahweh Shah, Barakatai Yahweh, Barakatai Yahweh Shah. 
Koh Allah Yam La Yahu Basim Yahu Sha Basim or Kakadash and um say um shalom to the next time Wa Baba Baba.